there's once again a jet flying around the safe zone. There it goes right now. Jeez, it's gonna scare Nugget. Nugget, are you okay? I, uh, I think Nugget's just fine. But yes, hello everyone, Fudgy here, and welcome back to another Unturned Life episode. Now, I might sound just a little bit different because I am currently recording in my brand new office. This is the first episode or first ever video I've actually recorded in this office right here. So it's a little bit echoey. I do need to adjust that. You know, it's pretty empty in here, but <laughs> that's why it's echoing. But on screen right now, I'm going to show you a little glimpse of my setup. But if you do actually want to see a setup tour or maybe some more pictures, let me know in the comment section down below and maybe I'll post a video on my brand new setup. It's not actually complete yet. I'm actually getting a new desk. Uh, the one I got is a little on the small side. I want to get one that's a little bit larger. So uh, yes, it's very much incomplete. My PC's on the floor at the moment, but it's, it's definitely getting there. It's a work in progress. But let me tell you what we're actually doing in this episode. Well, you probably already know, but we are heading over to the Blue Berets base to do some target practice. That's why I'm Pretty sure there was a jet flying around the sky doing some practice. I don't know why they're always flying so close to the safe zone. I think it's gone now. I can't hear it anymore. But yeah, it sounds like it's a big training day going on with the Blue Berets. I'm just uh, waiting for Reds to uh, arrive, pick me up, take me over to the Blue Beret base. And hopefully we get some target practice done and uh, I get better at shooting stuff. I think we're also using vehicles. I think that's the main aim for today. Oh man, I love this chicken so much right here. This is the best chicken ever. I still can't believe we've gone for the name Nugget. This was the highest liked comment. I hear knocking on the door. All right, it's reds. Oh, no, it's not. Hey, uh, what's up? That's, oh, it's Tabasco. Hey, buddy. Um, hey there. I couldn't keep up with the payment of the apartment. Oh. So I'm moving out. Oh, well, I'm sorry to hear that. Thank you for letting me know. Um, here, hang on one sec. Let me, let me head to your apartment. Show me, uh, which one's yours? Is it this one? Yeah, this one. Well, I don't think you ever really added any furniture in here, did you? No, I always was kind of poor. Oh, man, I'm sorry to hear that. Well, um, thanks for letting me know. Um, I'll tell you what, since you never really did anything to the place, it seemed like you didn't really stay here much. Um, you won't have to pay me anything, okay? I've got other businesses set up, so I'm all good. All right. Well, looks like this floor is now free well, to I'll rent out again. Okay, you. man. No worries. Thanks again for letting me know. If you ever want to uh, buy this place again or start renting, just let me know. And uh, hopefully, I'll have a floor available for you, okay? Okay, I will let you know. All right. Bye. Good stuff, man. Good stuff. Hey, Tabasco. What are you doing today, anyway? Um, I was coming to give you a gift for Christmas, actually. Oh, a gift. An early Christmas gift. Okay, what is it, man? I'm excited for this. I was hoping to spice up your place for Christmas, so I thought Ooh. I'd give you just a cool little gift to keep you warm over the winter month. Okay. Oh, so, dude! Hey, nice. Here, follow me, man. Let's go put it up right now. Yeah, this will definitely keep me nice and cozy. Yeah, I have no idea where I'm going to put this, though. Uh, not next to Nugget. Yeah, I guess this makes sense. Just next to the kitchen area. Oh, but what about the living area? I don't really go here anyway. Yeah, I'll place it down here. If I want to move it, I can. And place. Oh, it's so cozy. Tabasco, nice thank cozy. you. Thank you so much for this. And uh, I'm going to place this. Uh, let's see. I'll place it over here. You could probably place it over here, maybe. Oh, uh, well, I've gone for there. <laughs> it will do for now. Yeah, dude, much appreciated. I'll have to get you something uh, for Christmas. Okay, I'll be looking forward to it. All right, man. It won't be a chicken. Don't worry. You're safe, Nugget. You're safe. Ah! No, 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 no. Don't you touch Nugget. No. Well, dude, much appreciated for this. It will definitely keep me nice and cozy for the winter to come. And uh, I'll have to think of a gift for you. I'm sure I'll get you something very soon. Okay, thank you. See you later. All right, man. See you, buddy. There he goes. Where is Reds? Reds is taking ages, man. <laughs> he said that he wanted to take me to the uh, the Blue Beret base to do some training, and yet he's not here. Speaking of Tabasco's gift, if you have any suggestions for what we should give him, do let me know in the comment section down below, and uh, hopefully we'll have a gift for him very soon. But yeah, look, this is my um, stove. It goes through here, and the smoke goes up. We can even turn it on and off from here as well. Oh, no, I can't get it back on now. Well, it's turned off forever. I can hear someone get up the stairs. So is that Reds? I can definitely hear someone. Hey, oh, it is Reds. Hey, is he, he's taking these stairs instead. Whoa, hello. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, not too bad. How are you doing, man? 
Uh, we're doing pretty good. Good stuff, good stuff. We're ready if you are. Yeah, I'm all set. Don't want to waste the fuel here. There we go. That's better. Wait, I, I just realized I have an umbrella, so I can take a shortcut. Oh, my umbrella was not assigned. Hey, guys. Anyone got a splint? I broke my legs. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I need to invest in some splints. Thank you, Rudolph. Here Thank you, you. Thank you very much. Let's go to the Blue Beret base. Tabasco's diner. Hopefully, it'll still be open when yeah. we get back. So, uh, Reds. What is the plan for today? I know we're doing some uh, some training. I think you said target practice, right? I also uh, remember hearing about some vehicles. Uh, yeah, we got some tanks waiting for us at the base. We're going to take them down uh, to the shooting range and just have a bit of there. Uh, you can have a go on the turrets as well. Yes. I love the sound of this, man. I need to actually improve my accuracy. So, yeah, it definitely needs to be done. All right, I'll see you when we get there. We've made it to the Blueberry base. The, uh, the gate's open, which is good. It's good to be back. I feel like I haven't been here in a while. I often go past this place, but I never really go inside. So, yeah, it's nice to actually be back here in the Blue Ray base. Oh, yeah, Reds. Where's uh, Elias, by the way? I feel like I haven't seen him for a while. What's he up to? Yeah, he's pretty preoccupied at the moment. He's, he's got a lot of stuff going on, both in the lab, out in the field. And he's a busy man at the moment. Ah, uh, gotcha. No worries, no worries. So, yeah, we've got uh, our tanks lined up here. You can take the one if you want i can get you some shells as well yeah so let's do it you know i don't know if i've actually even shot one of these tanks before from the cannon whoa i've never even seen these shells before i don't think what the <laughs> they look crazy yes oh man I'm so, I'm so excited for this it's gonna be good all right i'm in oh this is really cool all right i'm not actually driving the tank though but i am in control of this oh <laughs> seems like the tanks are just a little bit too big for those shelters just there. <laughs> oh, that's funny. All right, onwards to the uh, the shooting range where we get to blow some targets up. So this should be epic. And you know what? I actually do genuinely need training in these things. So if the safe zone ever came under attack, I would be more than capable of taking out any targets. Not to mention, I do have a practice in the cannon which unfortunately was taken away from me. But uh, yeah, going back to uh, my uh, my new setup in the new office, the image that I've shown at the, uh, the start of this video, uh, you would see that my PC is actually on the floor and that's only temporary. I will be putting it on the desk once I get that bigger desk and I'll be cleaning up the cables and it's gonna look a lot more neat and tidy. So I'm really excited to finally get my, I guess my dream set up if you want to call it that. So not long from now, hopefully my setup will be nice and clean and exactly how I imagined it. And, you know, maybe I will post a video on it. Who knows? Oh, here we are. This is the firing range. All right, we've made it. I've only been here like once before, I think, or maybe twice. The first time was to, of course, fire those cannons, the overpowered cannons. But uh, here we are in the tank, ready to go. Oh, no. Zombies. Oh, no. Oh, no. Zombies, boys. Oh, we've actually got um, some real vehicles to take out. There's also some uh, some targets there. Quad bike by the looks of it. Wait, are we taking out a tank? Is, is that seriously what we're doing? Is that a good idea? That, that well, looks like yeah. it could be useful. Yeah, could, uh, these are our slightly older models. We haven't really had use for these in a while, so we figured we might as well use them for some target practice. Okay, well, I'm not complaining. I'm excited to uh, to blow it up. Oh, yeah, we camped here before as well. All the beds are still here. This is awesome. Is it all loaded and ready to go? Let me change seat. Oh, jeez. Uh, we might have a slight issue. I hope the drop is uh, big enough because the cannon can't quite go as far down as I'd like it to. If it can't, we can just slide it slightly down the hill. Okay, let, let, me, uh, let me aim for this tank real quick. Let me see what happens. Right. Three, two, one, fire. Okay, yep, I'm gonna have to go down the hill. Yeah, can someone roll me down a little bit just so I can uh, put the cannon down a little more? Yeah, that's perfect. I should be able to take out uh, just about all targets other than the vehicle dead ahead. I'm gonna aim for that little white truck on the side there. Can I, uh, can I engage? Yep, you can open fire, boys. Okay, opening fire now. All right, looks like it is just a little bit too low for me, but I'll go for another target this time. I guess that's the only issue with this tank right now. <laughs> it can't really shoot that low. Okay, and fire! 
Oh, direct hit on the quad bike. Quad bike down. Yes. Direct hit. That's what I like to see. Oh. Hey, guys. <laughs> would not be good if I fired now, would it? Yeah, you look so happy. <laughs> you look too happy for a cannon that's literally in your face right now. We have trust in you that you would. All right. Yeah. No, I won't do that. Don't worry. All right. Um, I'm going to open fire um, at the tank again. Here we go. Three, two, one. Fire. All right. Direct hit. Gonna need some more firepower. Oh, you got it. Good job. Good job. Okay, guys. Go for the APC. APC. Copy that. APC going down. All right. Three, two, one. Fire. Got it. APC down. Whoa. This tank is actually really powerful, guys. I gotta say. Oh, this is actually a lot of fun. You know what? It's a nice chilled episode. We're not doing anything too crazy, but uh, this training is uh, is a lot of fun. And these tanks are awesome. Oh, I wanted to take that out. He got it. Uh, can someone uh, roll me down the hill a little more, please? And uh, I'll take out this truck on the side here. That's perfect. That's perfect. There we go. All right. And let's fire. That's that taken care of. Very nice. Let's, uh, let's fire at the same time, okay? Once we've both reloaded. Takes a little while. <laughs> Is that you nodding your head? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, so if I ask you something, you say no. Would you shake your head? <laughs> nice. Is your cannon loaded? Oh, yes. Loaded. Uh, am I the best YouTuber ever? <gasps> I would shoot you so much right now. <laughs> All right, man. Let's just take out this target, okay? On my signal. Three, two... One fire. Oh, I think you might have missed a little bit there. Whoa, 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 what was that? Oh, you got a rocket launcher. Okay. So there's one more target for me to take out. However, I cannot see it from where I am. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the tank on the firing range and uh, hunt it down. I believe it's a dirt bike. All right, let's keep the lights on as well because it is getting dark out. Right, where is this vehicle? Yeah, apparently, according to Red, there's a dirt bike out here, but I don't see anything. Is it behind one of these blown up vehicles? Oh, I see it. I see it. It's right there. Oh, no. Did I just fire by mistake? I think I did. I did. Oh, misfire. <laughs> Would not want to do that in a real bow. Good thing this is only training. But yeah, I can see a dirt bike right there. As soon as the cannon's loaded, we'll take it out. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, and fire. What? Did that just go through the dirt bike? Are you kidding me? Right, let me uh, let me try to reverse a little bit. Maybe I'm just a tad too close in order to take it out, which sounds kind of ridiculous, but uh, we'll uh, we'll get it. Right, let's try this again and fire. What? How? How are we missing this dirt bike right now? Oh, are you kidding me? Oh wait, <laughs> the tank behind me is now trying to take it down as well. It's like the first person to uh, actually take it out wins. All right, here we go. Come on. Yes, I got it. Yes. I don't think that was a direct hit, but you know what? It did the job. All right, mission accomplished. I uh, I think that's enough tank training for me. And to be honest, I don't really want to use up too much ammo with my weapon. So I'll tell you what, I'll call it a day for Blue Beret training. I think that was very useful and uh, definitely something I needed to do. So uh, yes, my skills are all good in the tank now. I did it. All targets now annihilated. There we go. Mission accomplished. All right, fellas. I have a feeling that the diner is still open. Um, I know it's getting late, but if, we, if we're quick, we, we might just be able to get like a hot chocolate or something. What do you say? For sure. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yay. To the diner, everyone. But first, we got to drop the tanks off. So that might take some time. Got me. Oh, I missed. <laughs> oh, jeez. And we are once again back in the Blue Bray base. All right. So what we're going to do is drop off the tanks and then head back to the safe zone. Most likely in the same vehicle we arrived here in. So, yeah. Is that a deer? It is. If only, if only I had one more to take it out. Whoa. Don't want to get run over here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look out for it. Oh. Christmas is cancelled. I'm okay. The tank hurt a little bit, but I'm fine. Anyway, change of plan. We're actually taking an Osprey back to the safe zone so we can get there even faster. Ready for our hot chocolate at the diner. Fingers crossed, Tabasco hasn't closed up. Hey, um, dude, the headlamp. Could you turn it on for us? It's super dark in here. 
That's better. Thank you. Hmm, so I reckon a hot chocolate sounds good right about now. I'll see what kind of food Tabasco's got in store. Um, he also gave me indigo pies not long ago, so... I might sell them on for a profit at some point, because I don't plan on eating those at any point. But yeah, we're now in the safe zone. We're back at the Blue Beret headquarters. And, uh... Hopefully the diner's open. I don't see any lights on right now, but we are a little bit far away, so maybe that's why. Oh! Beautiful! That'll do. Alright, boys! To the diner! Let's go! I assigned my umbrella now, so hopefully I won't be breaking my legs as much. So we should be okay. Oh, I see lights! Yes! Where is he? Oh, no! Tabasco's grocery opening soon, just in time for Christmas. Hello. Oh! Ooh. I hear him, but I can't see him. We've just been doing some fishing. We're oh, there he is! You're catching fish. Okay, was well, that the special tonight? Because, uh... Kind of fancy some yep. food. It's really dark in here as well. Do you have power? Oh, there we go. That's much better. Now I can actually see. Okay. Wait, hang on a minute. What happened to the other chicken? It's under the table there. I called this oh. one Freddy and the oh, other yeah. one called Barry. Freddy and Barry. Is this one Freddy right here? Yep. Freddy and Barry. Very nice. Right next to some turkey just there. Yeah, so could I, uh, can I get some hot chocolate for me and the blue berets, please? And also that fish you just caught. Bit of a weird combination, but yeah. I don't really mind. I'm just super hungry right now. What is that, sardines or what did you catch? Oh, no, no. You guys are going to get something better than this. Oh, okay. This oh. is my fish. Oh, nice. You guys can have some squid. Wait, main... Co oh, squid. Cooked squid. Oh. And also hot chocolate. Very strange. Oh, I'm popcorn for reds. I'll pay soon Tabasco. Don't I worry, man. No, remember, it's Christmas. Season oh. Of giving. Oh, thank you. Hear that, Blue Berets? It's on the house tonight. Well, on that note, it's time for me to end this episode right here. So, I really hope you all enjoyed. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe. And I shall see you in the next one. Goodbye. Oh.